Hi, my name is Becky Shrimpton. Here is the video pitch logline for Stop Signs, written by Catherine Ruchent. Genre, sci-fi. Type, feature screenplay. Logline, a handful of average people in multicultural Los Angeles without the aid of top gun fighter pilots, SETI scientists, or the President of the United States must stage their own Independence Day to fight off an alien invasion. Pitch, I have a sci-fi film to pitch to you today. It's titled Stop Signs. Thematically, it deals with the need to work together, no matter how calamitous the circumstances. It's a little like Independence Day meets Monsters. Our protagonist is Merrick Donaldson, a Scottish immigrant and overly hardworking construction worker who will do anything for his demanding ex-wife and four children. She left him, but he still loves her madly. This is really Merrick's journey, as we find at the beginning of Act One, because one day he wakes up and finds the world has ended. He soon discovers his ex-wife and children are dead, too. All this started about two months earlier with endless rain, worldwide floods, and a strange and deadly mold. Then came the blackouts, dead crows, and livestock, and odd machinery from the sky remaking the global landscape into a checkerboard of scenes from a World War II movie, barren fields or silent buildings. Although beaten down emotionally, a glimpse of a spacecraft high above the clouds at the end of the first act sends Merrick on a quest to fight back. In Act 2, he meets M.C., an illegal alien, feisty, funny, pretty, and sexy, who quickly starts to fall for her rescuer, Merrick. He also finds a co-worker and friend, Cutter. The three team up to destroy the spacecraft, and Merrick figures out a way to use the alien technology to wipe out the aliens themselves. The aliens show themselves at the midpoint as lightbulb-shaped heads with large black eyes about a tiny body that seems far too small to carry that noggin. They want our planet. Why? We don't know but they're willing to kill us all to get it. They badly injure Merrick, but a vet from Wisconsin sews him back together, but she also manages to infect him with that strange mold. In Act 3, this team of construction workers, vets, and illegal aliens blow up the spaceship. Then, knowing the rain and mold were worldwide occurrences, and knowing they can bring the ships down, they leave for another city to take down another and another. To sum up, this is a sci-fi movie with a great deal of action and strong characters, set on a small personal angle on huge apocalyptic events. Its intimate feel will appeal to an audience's heart and its action to an audience's adrenaline craving. WGA registration number WG1597650.